My beloved people of God, I greet you all in the holy name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. With great love, I just want to greet you early in the morning. Every day with Holy Spirit, it is a great privilege to live with the Spirit of the Lord. Even today, early in the morning for your thought, I just want to read you one verse from the Bible. And Caleb gave her the upper springs and the lower springs from Judges 1 and verse 15. This is what I read you right now. Caleb gave the blessings to his daughter and that's what mentioned in this verse. He gave her the upper springs and the lower springs. My dear people of God, Today, the truth that the Spirit of the Lord wants to tell you is the anointing that you have received through Him is residing into you. The anointing that you have received, what you should do it, you should kindle it and pray when you fill yourself in the Spirit and pray continuously. Two important blessings will work into you. In this verse, God has taught me a lesson. One thing is the blessings from upper springs. That is the heavenly blessings from the Lord. And secondly, the lower springs. That is the worldly blessings. The prosperity, joy and gladness will be given to you. The Spirit of the Lord which is poured into you will fill with both of these blessings what we should do to receive it. The anointing that you have received, you should fill yourself in the prayer. Morning itself, you need to go and know His will, commit yourself to His will and say to Him, Lord, the Spirit of the Lord, I am giving my schedule into your hand. You lead it, you guide it and pray in a lonely place. When you pray continuously, I tell you, all the worldly blessings will come in search of you. And also you will be filled with the heavenly blessings. One thing you must understand in the prophetic book of Isaiah, chapter 32 and verses 15, it says, Until the Spirit is poured upon us from the high, and the wilderness becomes a fruitful field. See, when you are filled in the anointing continuously, all the wilderness like family situations, a personal life will automatically prosper. It will become a fruitful field. Let God fill your life with such blessings. Just bow your heads and close your eyes and pray along with me. A loving heavenly father, you have the authority over heaven and the earth. You are our king, our Lord. Father, Spirit of the Lord, every day we are walking with you. We are living with you. We are expecting from you. Even now, as your children pray, let them be filled with the heavenly blessings and also with the blessings of this world, Lord. They are asking for it. Father, Spirit of God, in the Bible we read about you as you are the river. And the name river has been given to you. Let that living springs flow into the lives of your children. Let them receive a new kind of anointing today, Lord. Let this whole day be a day of success and victory. Let the God of peace be with them. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. God bless you. Our address, Jesus Meets Ministries, number 4, Kavarapalaya Main Road, Abadi, Chennai 54, India. Telephone number 9841252836 Email ID gpsrobinson at hotmail.com gps.office at jesusmeets.org Website address www.gpsrobinson.org